Bertie County is a prime example in the demise of rural America. I'm not leaving because I won't leave. I'm leaving because there's nothing to keep me here. There's not a whole lot of opportunities for our kids here. I mean, school, I hate it. My dad hated it. My granddaddy hated it. I'm carrying on a tradition. We have kids coming through that door any minute. What if you could bring back shop class, but orient the projects around things that the community needed? So here's the challenge. We have one full year to build a community project. Is this what we're going to be doing all year? Give me a zero. You got to be out your mind. All right, let's get to work. It's not a typical class. We don't have a desk. <laughs> it's crazy. What I hope to see in 16 weeks is that little model, full size. We're making something for the town of Windsor, so we have to make it right. We're racing the clock. Throw that stuff away. There's nails sticking up. All I'm asking is that you do a halfway decent job. It's at the end of this little pep talk. The pressure's on now. Our offered salaries have been taken off the table. Bertie County has never paid him a dime. We're at our absolute limits. I'm not having this discussion. Everything just fell apart. Yes, it does have to be perfect. We just decided that something had to give. It's bigger than the students. It's bigger than their education. At this point, it's the talents. They're trying to teach us how to look outside the box. Why? Why is something the way it is? Make something better out of everything. Are the things you're doing making a difference in anyone's lives? I think it's critical that people rally around this thing. I just want these kids to be excited about coming to school every day. It's just amazing. <laughs> You always need to keep putting ideas together to make a better one. I've never been a part of something so big. Breakthrough moments happen so rarely that half the time you think you're just doing a lousy job as a teacher. But when it does happen, I mean, it just floors you. The farmer's market is the beginning. To stand here and look around, it's just amazing. It really was a blessing. I love those guys. I'm just, I'm so proud of them. This is something that really can transform lives. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, and it happened to us. Mm -hmm.